Hello everybody, welcome to Fawin Channel. I am Fawin and this is my channel. Today we're playing some more FTL in a segment I like to call, Will Fawin Survive? Um, I should have explained it already in the first uh, uh, episode, but just for a recap, I cannot load saves, I cannot hire more crew, and we play until we die. And if you saw the last episode, we almost bit it. Um, got lost a little bit of health, but we beat that pirate ship and got some salvage. So let's jump to the next system. Uh, let's go. This is gonna be a nebula. It's gonna wreak havoc on our shield, but let's do it. Uh oh, danger. You see a number of derelict ships near this beacon. After a short time, you hear the telltale sounds of a teleporter and shouts coming from within the ship. You've been boarded! Oh, no! Oh, man. Who, who's boarded us? Who's boarded us? What's getting shot at? Oh, they're right next door. They are right next door. Get in there. Get in there. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That's the best place because we're gonna get heal healed while fighting them while they're dying. Oh my god. Who are are they pirates? What are they? Who are fighting? Burko and Williams. What was up with that? Alright, Micro go back. Kale go back. I'll fix the door control. Oh, you know what? I think the nebula messes with our um, security stuff, and so we can't see anything at all, which, oh man, that just, whew, that was close. All right. Let's get out of here. <laughs> that was a trap. That was a trap! Okay. Um, oh, here comes the fleet chasing after us with this little warning. Like, buffer, if you're ever in there, that means you gotta get the hell out of there now. Okay, so we're not gonna go back, otherwise we'll be in that buff. Uh, let's just move here, we got a lot more options over here. Alright, engage! You come across an asteroid mining colony. They message you Im immediately saying, Greetings, our supplies of mining explosives have run out ever since the rebels blockaded the system. Do you have any extra explosives? Okay, so we can give them a missile. Offer to solve their problem by launching a missile. We just blow shit up for them. Um, give them the requested five missiles. Oh, that's gonna really cripple us if we do. Give them, ah. Uh, well, let's, one missile is fine. We might get some loot from this, so let's go for it. While I appreciate your enthusiasm, we have certain protocols for the use of explosives around the workplace. Launching a military-grade weapon in our minds isn't exactly what I would call union-friendly. Uh, I am not giving you five missiles. Fine, you know what? Fuck off. Figure your, sh figure your shit out. I understand. Good luck out there. We'll try to make do with what we have. Yeah, you will, because I am not giving up the missiles. That's what is going to save my ass out of here. All right. Let's get out of here. Jump. Oh, there's a store. Um, I think we have enough time where we can go to the store and jump back and then keep going. So let's let's head over to the store. Maybe we can fix our ship. Get some more fuel or something. The space station here has a traveling merchant who shows you his wares. Okay. Um. Fix all. That's gonna be like all of our points. But we are. <sighs> yeah, we'll just we'll just get a little bit there. Um. So we don't need these parts. Can I sell these parts? No, I don't need the parts though. I don't want the parts. Oh, whatever. Uh, if you know how to sell these parts, please comment for me because I have no idea. There's no option here. I'm not selling my weapons. Even though that burst laser is 40 points. Um, we'll grab some more fuel. Um, yeah, one more fuel. Okay. And... I think that's it. We'll fix one more, two more. And we're, okay. I think that's all we can really do at this point. 
So let's jump back over here and see what's up, and then oh, distress signal. We'll we'll check out that distress signal a little bit later. So let's see what's back here. Oh, it's like Earth. Your scans reveal an ore refinery and several factories, all standing still and empty. No life signs detected. Can we go investigate and get some cool stuff? Guess not. All right. Um. We'll go here so we can get to that distress signal. So engage. Card says, "Oh, in danger. Oh, rebel fighter. Relationship hostile. You stumble across a forward scout of the rebel fleet. Rebel scum. Okay. Hopefully this won't be as bad as the last guy we just fought. Let's go. They are powering up their FTL. If they get away, they will no doubt warn the fleet of your position." Okay, so we need to take out his engines, his shield. We got everything down here. Um, okay, let's go. Uh, this thing can't go quite too fast enough. Come on. Uh oh, he's already firing. Oh, oh, oh. Um, get his engines and his weapons. Oh, we damaged his weapons. All right, we're we're sitting pretty so far. Oh man, um, missiles, take out his shields. Lasers, take out his weapons. There we go. Oh no, his engines are back up. Um, but he's almost dead. We almost got him. Finish him off. Woo, did it. All right. <sighs> the ship breaks apart and you, real and you are relieved to know that you are still one step ahead of the fleet. Whew. Oh, we got a ton of scrap from that too. And a missile. Oh man, we're running low on missiles. Okay. Um, man, we didn't take any damage really. Sweet. Should we go back to the store for more missiles and then go to the stress signal, or just go straight for the distress signal? We're gonna go to the store and pick up some more missiles. We we we're gonna need them. They're like our bread and butter here. Um, and a couple more. Oh, that's all the fuel they have. All right, let's go. To the distress signal. Now, if you've ever watched Rick and Morty, what's the number one rule of space travel? Check out the distress signals. I'll let you watch this show to explain why. All right. There's a slug interceptor. Ooh, it's, I don't know what that means. Hello, we used our last FTL fuel to jump to the station. They indicate a burnt out husk of debris and warped metal. As you can see, the war must have spread to this sector. We've been stranded ever since. Um, you know what? Let's help these guys. They might uh, they might give us some like missiles or, or something. So we'll give them two fuel points. You give them the fuel. All right, thank you. Here, have this extra scrap as payment. Oh, sweet. Oh, 20 scrap? Oh, I think we can upgrade something then. We'll get some more power. And we'll put the powers to the engines. Up. Oh. oh, we have to hit accept. Okay, accept. Now we'll put that power to the engines and it made us a little more evasive. Okay. All right. Um. Oh, there's another distress signal, but we need to get to that exit. Can we? Yeah, we can. Ah. Uh, um. I'm gonna guess if we jump here, this is the warning's gonna be about here, and then we jump here, and the warning's gonna be here, and then we have to jump to that exit where the warning's gonna be. Um. Oh, this is tough. Uh, let's, if I was the captain of a real spaceship, um, uh, screw it, let's go to the stress signal, warp factor, whatever, go! You locate a nearby human mining colony where an unknown disease has spread virulently. They are setting up a quarantine to contain it, but a riot has bro broken out. Sending your crew to help the control the crowds? Okay. Now, I have played this game before, but that was like years ago. I know that in situations like this, it's really random. Um, if I send a crew member down, they might get the disease and die, or die and during riot control, or um, everything goes fine and I get a bunch of crap. That would be awesome, but to be perfectly honest, it sounds a little too risky, and if there's riots down there, what is one or two or even three more guys gonna really do? So, you know what? 
uh, figure it out. You're on your own, kids. Ignore the request and move on. Unfortunately, your mission is too important, and you're not willing to risk your crew. You prepare to move on. Okay, guys, we're going to call it here for today. Uh, so far, ship is still in one piece. Got into a couple battles, and we're doing all right. Whew. Okay. If you like what you've seen, please like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Take care, everybody, and be back next time for more FTL to see if Fawen can actually survive this. Take care, everybody.